What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video gonna learn how to remove or and change the browser tab icon that is this icon right here that used to appear into when you are navigating to your sites and if you install WordPress if you recently have started WordPress on your site, if your site came from hosting using WordPress, you can see the WordPress icon into the browser tab. Normally it can be WordPress icon, your hosting company icon, and this is very bad for your website branding because when you see the browser tab, you can see about the site that is referring to. For example, this is the WordPress.org website. Can you see the browser tab icon into my browser tabs? into the upper side of the screen. Here is the Visual Moto site. You can see the browser tab icon right here. So here into the Visual Moto sandbox website, why is the WordPress icon right here? We most remove this. And this is what we're gonna learn into this video. We're gonna learn in three different methods, okay? So before we can start, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, okay? So let's get it started. First of all, go to our WordPress dashboard, okay? If you are using the new WordPress 2023 version, right here, let me show you. This theme came with a new idea of full site editor that happens right here, okay? That is the editor of the entire website. It is still in beta version and honestly does not work very, very well because have not all the options that we need so what are you gonna do to access the customizer pinion it's going to the website URL deleting the text gonna be yourwebsite.com yourwebsite.net wp pawn admin slash customizer.php this is the link that you're gonna be accessing okay customize.php okay without the r my mistake so here we're gonna be able to access the wordpress customizer panel from here we're gonna be able to click on site identity Right here is the website title, the tagline, and the site icon. Can you see that we do not have uploaded a site icon? If you do not upload a site icon, you're gonna be not seeing the WordPress default icon. We're gonna need to upload our brand logo right here. For example, this is a Visual Moto site, so we're gonna upload the Visual Moto logo. However, you must upload your branding logo. Click on it. Here is a preview of how this gonna looks like. We're gonna need to crop the image. Let me publish. And if you reload the site, can you see the new logo right here into the browser tab? This is what is gonna work. So on site identity, remember to access your domain.com, WP admin, customize.php. This is only if you are using the WordPress new default theme, okay? If you are not using the WordPress default theme, let me show you the, the example. Let me change my theme. I'm gonna go to Appearance, Themes, and change my theme to the Enzo Free WordPress Team by Visual Moto, okay? In this team, besides of pre-built websites and other special options that you can do, you have this option right here under Appearance, of your WordPress left side of menus, you have the customize and most of the teams have this option. So go to customize and we're gonna access the same URL that we did access typing onto the browser tab, wp admin customizer.php. And from here, as you can see, if you're using Enzo, you're gonna be able to see a way more options to customize your site, but you still have the site identity. And on site identity, we're gonna be able to upload our site icon. There, normally it's called fav icon, okay? However, if you are not using one of the teams that have the customizer and are not using the default WordPress team, 
we have another option to upload the site browser tab icon and gonna be by installing a plugin so go to our wordpress dashboard access plugins hover mouse of plugins click on add new into the search plugins we're gonna have we're gonna type favcon hero okay just like this heroic favcon generator and this is the plugin that we are looking for heroic favcon generator click on install now it's by hero teams Click on activate button, it gonna redirect you, okay? No need to worry. We're gonna be into the plugins list. Where we can see the list of all the currently installed plugins on our site. Here is the plugin. And if you hover your mouse over settings into the left side of menus, you're gonna see a new button under, under the settings table called Heroic Favorite Generator. We're gonna click on it. And here we're gonna select our Fivecon. I'm gonna select this new one. Here is the Fivecon. It does explain how does it gonna looks like. Okay. We can replace the the icon in different devices, which is really really good. Okay. Replace generated image, restore generated image. So into different sizes, different devices, different styles, we can have different images. Save chains, normally want all the same, but it's good to know that I have the option. And we have a new browser tab fave icon, okay? Just remember, if you set one right here, you cannot set one into the customizer panel, okay? Remember this. And we are good to go. I hope one of these three methods help you okay i hope you guys enjoy this video feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question and don't forget to check out our free wordpress plugin the borders in order to have more widgets elements templates and tools to build your site using the wordpress native block editor or elementor and in addition you're gonna have pre-built websites that you can import with a single click in the case that you want okay and all for free to install just go to our wordpress dashboard plugins add new search for borderless click on install and activate it okay moreover in the case there are in needs of an amazing free wordpress team with extra options more design options extra templates more pre-built websites that you can import with a single click just go to our wordpress dashboard appearance themes add new search for enzo wordpress team click on install and activate it it's completely free okay and as a final Nazi, in the case that there are in need of extra design elements, premium options, premium pre-built websites to import with a single click, premium icons, extra images, and our full support while doing your site, go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass or the Enzo Pro or Borderless Pro licenses and go premium, okay? And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best!